Well, you know, it has been a little over 24 hours since Auburn University appointed former Boise State head coach Brian Harson as their new leader. Tomorrow, Harson will officially be introduced in Alabama. As for what he was doing here today, John Bates has the story. Man, it's been one heck of a last day or so for you and your teammates over there at Boise State. Have you guys heard from, from Brian Harson following his decision to leave his alma mater and go to Auburn? Yeah, we actually had a team meeting this morning over Zoom, and, you know, it was really good to hear from Coach Harson and hear, obviously, his side of the story, what he had to say, because, you know, things travel fast through media, and um, it's, it may seem tough on our side because we don't get, you know, a clear explanation right away because everything just travels so fast. But um, I think we all respect the heck out of Coach Harson and what he's done here. Um, you know, he's Boise State through and through. He's alumni. He played here. He's coached here. He's shown what it means to be a Bronco. And, um, you know, it's a business at the end of the day. And that's something we all got to understand is that, you know, Coach Harson did things the right way. He, uh, you know, he talked to us. He cleared the air of anything. Um, you know, he did it the right way, the Bronco way. And so respect the heck out of him and what he's done for me and what he's done for, you know, the last seven or eight seasons that he's been here. And um, super excited to see what his what he does in his career moving forward. So with Harson gone, with Harson gone, what is next for Boise State? Well, today, just 24 hours after he became a dad, co-defensive coordinator and D-line coach Spencer Danielson was named the interim head coach over for the Broncos. Boise State President Marlene Trump did provide an update on the coaching search, saying that a national search for a permanent replacement is underway. The university will use the same search firm that they are using to try and find an athletic director. President Trump then added that due to current circumstances, the process to hire will be accelerated. Over the